Hello, North Vegan here, back with another episode of Ill 2 Stormavik, the Battle of Kuban. We are here in our Lisanov 2. We're going to be doing a d cargo para drop this time. And we are going to be doing it right up against the front lines. We have a little bit of an infantry push coming from the enemy here. And we have some uh, troops here trying to hold the line and so we're going to come and deliver some ammo and supplies to them hopefully in an expeditious manner and then uh, they can hold off the attack from the enemy I'm just gonna get lined up a little bit better here I really hate that sometimes I try to hit autopilot I mean auto level and I hit autopilot because <laughs> autopilot is uh, well, it's crazy all right so anyway we uh, we are chugging along here at a, uh, a hefty 230 kilometers per hour at uh, 300 meters and uh, looking pretty good our, our temperatures are a little bit high I've got all the radiators open though so should uh, start to cool down a little bit as we head off on our way All right, so if we take a look at our map here, we are on our way to sector 1025. We will pick up our fighter rendezvous here and they will escort us the remaining of the way. Uh, once we get to waypoint number three, we'll so drop the supply containers in the specified area as close to our positions as possible. The drop zone will be marked by yellow smoke beware of enemy fighters in the area so that's uh, pretty frightening but we'll try to do some sort of circular pattern when we do our drop so that whenever we uh, do drop the cargo it won't be scattered out for miles for the, uh, the folks on the ground to pick it up they can just go pick it up all in pretty much one location so let's uh, let's keep going and see if we can arrive without too much trouble. All right, we are coming up on our rendezvous point now. We see six fighters that are uh, trolling around in the area over these little lakes. And I'm assuming those will be our escorts, probably P-39s again. Can't say for sure from here, but let's take a look. This is a lag. Yeah, so we've got the uh, lags flying escort force. Chunky boys. Got the chunky boys. All right, this is Flight Marabou in combat sector over. Let's see what the lags do for us here. I think I'd rather have the P-39, but uh, beggars can't be choosers, as they say. So uh, we'll just go ahead and let the uh, lags do their thing, and then we'll head on out for the target area, which is 10, 20, about 35 kilometers from our current position. So let's uh, let's get going. All right, we have passed over Obinskaya now. We should be getting to our target area soon. We should be, be on the lookout for our yellow smoke. Uh-oh, engage nearest air target. Let me make sure, I don't remember if I turned my gunners on. I think I did, but, oh, yep, there they are. I see two targets. Okay, oh boy. Still don't see the yellow smoke. How far are we out from the target area? About Still about five kilometers. I'm gonna turn just a little bit more to the right here. Oh, yep, there's yellow smoke right there, okay. Sweet. All right, 
We're going to fly in. We are going to go slightly to the left of the mark. We're going to fly in, drop our drop our load in a circular pattern around the smoke, hopefully, and uh, get the heck out of here. There's our escort, hopefully. <laughs> and uh, oh, there's three enemies. Okay, like they are getting ready to engage. Yep, there they go, they're diving on them. Oh my god, I better turn on the camera so we can catch some of that action. Oh lord. It is a dogfight, for sure. It's a furball. Oh my god, I'm nervous. I'm gonna be flying right underneath that mess. Oh my god. Oh my god, let's get a little lower. Let's get a little lower. Oh God, <laughs> sitting ducks, man. We're gonna be sitting ducks. Okay. Maybe they'll stay busy with them and not, uh, I don't see a bunch of tracers at the moment. Drop on my command, you got it, buddy. When we pass this little clearing up ahead of us, we'll go ahead and open our Bombay door. Oh, somebody's dropping out of the sky. I don't know who it is. Okay. Oh, there goes yellow tracers. That's the enemy firing. Oh, God. Come on, lags. Take them out. Take them out. Oh, God. Okay. Let's go ahead and, uh, when we pass this little clearing, we're going to open our Bombay doors. Somebody is tumbling out of the sky. Oh, God. Please don't let that be a German plane right there. Open Bombay doors. Oh my god. Oh, I hope my gunners are ready. I hope my gunners are ready. Into the drop zone. We're going to circle around this yellow area here. And we're going to drop and get the heck out of here. I see gunfire on the ground as well. Oh, shoot. Okay. I'm going to try to drop it in this clearing if we can for our buddies on the ground. Okay. Oh, somebody's engaging us. Oh, my God. All right. There they go. There you go, boys. That's your stuff. We're out of here. We're out of here. I gotta get out of this place. <laughs> See if we can live. Okay. Critical objective completed. Return to base. You got it. I just want to live, Lord. I just want to live. 
All right, I'm gonna turn on the auto level, or autopilot rather, and I'm gonna go over to our gunner. There we go. And let's just keep an eye out for uh, fighter activity. Somebody's going down, oh my God. Two uh, Nazi planes spraying our legs. I can't tell what this is. If it's friend or foe. Hopefully our uh, boys can distract them long enough for us to get away. I haven't heard any gunfire from our turrets to really speak. Oh my god. Oh, another lag down. Jeez. They are just demolishing those lags. See two pilots down already, third one going down. I think this might be a German coming after us right here. I can't say for sure. I think that might be a German. The rest of them seem to be dog fighting. And ground fire coming up. Yep, that's a German right there. That's ground fire coming up at him. All right, boys. Steady. 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 Ah, shoot, I just shot myself. <laughs> I think they got a son. <laughs> Indiana Jones. Reload the gun. Oh, I lost him. Ah, oh, I lost him. There he is, okay. I think I might have got him. Of course, he got us too, so. Comes around, goes around. Ammo's empty. Oh no! Somebody, somebody bring me some ammo! Oh my god. Oh god, there's two of them! Oh jeez. Alright. Autopilot off. Whoa! I'm glad I took control when I did. Gads. Oh, dang it. All right. Get you some of that. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, God. No, no. Okay. Oh, we're on fire. All right. Time to eject, boys. Get out. Get out. Eject. Eject. Get out. Well, 
Did everybody get out? There it goes. There goes our speed, our, uh, our air truck. Are we inside of friendly territory? I think so. Dang. Hopefully we're not injured or captured. <laughs> One truck down. <laughs> Completed secondary objectives, airdrop and takeoff. Let's take a look at the map here. Oh, geez. Oh, we went right by an airfield. Should have stayed there with that airfield. Let's see what we got here. Uh, friendly lag destroyed. 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 <laughs> friendly yak destroyed. Another friendly yak destroyed. Golly. My airdrop was completed, so that's good. And then we uh, flew by this airfield, and then we got shot down. If I would have noticed there was an airfield there, I was probably still in the gunner at that at that position. I probably would have just stayed there. And look, there was a lag destroyed back here too, while they were waiting on me. <laughs> so let's see what happens with that uh, fiasco. <clears throat> okay, I did lose the plane. Yep, crashed. All right. We are back at the airfield. We've got a special paradrop to do. Oh, interesting. Oh, it's a nighttime paradrop, too. Oh, interesting. Okay. A night paradrop. I don't know how that's going to work with YouTube, but uh, sounds pretty interesting. So we'll, we'll, we'll try it out and see if it, it may be just like completely black and you can't see anything. So, but I hope you enjoyed this episode. If you did, be sure and hit that like button. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.